welcome to the London vlog. I look a bit rough, sorry, I've literally been up since. Well, we've literally been up since. So, Hello. if you don't already know, this is Liv. She was on my podcast. If you haven't already watched it, make sure you do. Um, and we've come to London basically for two days to Decorex, which is like an interior design convention event. So, we've literally come here for two days to enjoy that and a little bit of sightseeing and shopping today, interiors, you know, all that good stuff. And then tomorrow going to the event so i'm super excited we're just going to go to our hotel we're staying in h10 hotels which looks amazing the interior looks fab so we were like yeah we need to stay there so we're just walking there now we've been walking for about seven years so i will show you a little room tour and we're going to freshen up change outfits and put some makeup on so we look like we actually want to be here you know um so yeah we will see you shortly This is the fabulous hotel ever, like look at look at the detail in the walls. We haven't even gotten a room yet. Go on, Lindsay, do the honours. Leave your suitcase outside. <laughs> Ooh. And we're in. And we're in. Ooh. <gasps> oh. <gasps> oh my god. Two interior designers loving it already. <gasps> Oh my god, use. Oh my god. How gorgeous. Oh my god, look at the artwork on the back. So, cute little chair, lamp situ, print. This, oh my god. Let's see what view we've got. Oh, wait, do you know what? That's not a bad view, you know, use. Little street view one. Oh no, I love it. I feel like we could get like a little, like, put your croissants and be like, morning. <laughs> Like people do on Instagram. Coffee. Love that. Put the paper <gasps> the city, yeah. Now how gorgeous this room we've had, isn't it? I can't wait to like freshen up. Okay, there's the loo. You're gonna have to hear me. I'm on my way. <laughs> oh no, gorge. <gasps> do you know what? I stayed in a hotel. No, <laughs> Sorry, like, a hotel I stayed in in Barcelona. I can't think of the name of it. I'm gonna find it. But it's like being on holiday, but in London. This is gorgeous. I love it, right? So we're just gonna freshen up. Oh, by the way, after the day, not a vibe when you look like you're flipping tourist with this. But um, I've just literally got a tracksuit on from Arnie, which is super comfy. Um, a blazer that I got from a boutique, but I'll link something similar. And Mark Jacobs bag. Who do I think I am? Um, but yeah, I'm so excited. It's gonna be very much an interior design day, um, interior shopping, see a nice sight, and also we're going to a gorgeous meal tonight in Harry's Bar. Um, which is supposed to have the most delicious food so I can't wait to share that if not already make sure you are subscribed and if you're not already as well make sure you follow me on Instagram hey just me again having my glow up just put my makey on can we just cope with how gorgeous that city view is please and as well like we've literally just unpacked but how much of a fab idea is that having artwork as a headboard honestly amazing <laughs> Oh my god, Jesus. We are just going to Christmas World. 
Oh my god, I can't cope. I'm recording on my phone and not my camera because I am a little bit nervous, I'm not gonna lie, in case you get told off. But, oh my god, look at that bubble. Oh my god, I need Christmas decorations from here. We are in our elements. <laughs> look at the bear. Oh my god, gorgeous. Oh, the baubles are gorgeous. I really want one. No, look at them over there. Oh my god, no use, look at these. I feel like I need one of these for me tree. I might get one, you know. How much are they? They're a tenner, that's actually not that bad for Harrods. Love it. No, I love it. Oh my god, I cannot cope with the baubles in here, you know. I love this one. How gorgeous is that? There's actually so many unreal ones. I love them. Oh, this is gorgeous. I wish that was in another colour. Oh, they've got gold. My tree's going to be very, like, quite a muted palette, like, beiges and whatnot. Oh, my God. No, that is stunning. £20 for a bubble. <laughs> Mortgage. Oh, stop it. Look at these. No, I'm obsessed, you know. I feel like I want to buy one, do you know what I mean? I mean, yeah. Let's see. Yeah. Oh, I love that one. How much is that? Oh, that's a bargain. No, you've got to get that one. Gorge. No, I like that. They've got gorgeous silver ones here as well. And I've just picked this one up. I think this is the one I'm going to go for, you know. It's got Harrods on the back and it's got like this sort of ad. That's going to go on my elf tree though. But then I want one for my studio tree, but just nothing's feeling vibey, you know? Not at the moment, anyway. It's all like gold, bears, just standard. Oh, yous, look at the little Harrods winter bears. Christmas bear 2021, he's called Angus. Oh, I love him. I love him. Oh, this tree is much better. Yes, we love this tree. More vibes on here. Oh my God, look at that crown. That's funny. Oh wow, the merchandise on here. Yes, much better. What is that? Oh my god, that's like a snake wrap around decoration. Whoa, unreal. This is more vibey down here. Oh, look at that reindeer over there. <laughs> oh my god. That is a bit of me, you guys. That is a bit of me. Oh wow. That tree is fab. Oh my god, oh my god, my mate from work would love these. I need to send them immediately. Oh my god, £14 for these. They are a bit of me. I can't justify £14 for them. Yeah. What is that? Is that £14 as well? Oh, I feel like. Do you reckon I, I could do that? Get bubbles from Hobbycraft. Oh my god, inspired you guys. Oh my god, Jews, I'm not over these decorations. That's the that iris. I can never pronounce her say name. What's her say name? App, app, or something. I don't know. Oh my god. That's so cute. It's like Chanel Jews. That's fun as well. These are so pretty as well. They're literally like earrings. On real. I love them. The little clamps. How much are they? 16. Oh, I really love them. Yeah. They've given us a bit of detail there. The decoration. Oh, These little pink fans. Yes, please. Stun on them, you know. Oh my god, look at that cage. The autumn and an R in that. Their cages are gorgeous. They're like an all year round staple. We were obsessed with these. Decoration with the rooms. I'd be scared, you know. I'm just loving this theme completely, you know. <gasps> Them faces are amazing. I'm just going to touch anything. Oh my god, I'm like, they're a fortune. I'm not even going to touch them. Oh my god, yeah, the Mackenzie Childs. Wow, they're expensive. I will tag them below in the description on Amara Home. <gasps> That's gorgeous. <gasps> wow. Oh my god, Jews, I am in H&M Home on Regent Street and I am obsessed getting a huge merchandise and like inspiration. Oh, well. Look at this new collection that they've got. We'll have to go and take a look. Oh my god, I can't cope with the new collection. This literally is a bit of me. 
I'm gonna leave the links to the products by the way in the description because you need it. Wow. <gasps> Look at that. No. How gorgeous are they? So so fab and they have like a whole like lighting department as well. The candle stick holders gorgeous. I love their marble pots. They are as well. Look at this big vase. But no, look at this lighting. So like I feel like in real life it's very hard to see like what these lamps look like. But well, here you can just see the detail in them is gorgeous, it really is. Honestly, just everything about the merchandising is gorgeous. Look at that cushion for that. I can't get over it, you know. Love them as well, them vases are stunning. So, so pretty. Decorative object that everyone has. I do love it. That terracotta vase is gorgeous, isn't it? Even the plain one. That plain one's gorge. Have they got it in mini? It's technically a plant pot over 23 99 It's quite good. I will love them tea light holders. This is vibey as well, isn't it? I'm not over how gorgeous it is in here though. It puts on our oh, one's a shame. Oh gorge. I just love the merchandise in here of HM. Need a new merchandiser, hit me up because I would love to do it. Love that. Have all your jewellery in there. Beautiful. Just look how fab it is. Use it huge. Amazon upstairs. We're gonna go upstairs in a minute as well. I'm sorry about the sunlight, but I wish you could see all the amazingness of this. Love that lamp in a weird way as well. And all of this, do you know what? I'm desperate for this, it's sold out online. I'm thinking of picking it up, but I can't bother walking around London with it. And the same with the bars. Be well to walk around with the bars, you know what I mean? Oh my god, there's an upstairs. It's all like the dining and, and things like that. Oh my god. How fab are these bowls? I just love this wall. Oh, I wish it was like this in our shop. Hey, do I have to come to London every time I want to come to a decent HM? Oh, I just love it all. Just everything. Gorgeous. Oh my god, hi. So we just stopped up with Pretz. A little soup on the go. We are booked for tea later, so we don't want anything too crazy. Um that HM home was unreal. We didn't buy nothing. We were really good. Um, and we're just people watching at the moment. Watching. We were saying how like famous is that say. Like, you know, when lads eat compared to girls, you've got a shovel of bodies that I'm glad I'm watching. Is that his body and two bites? Two bites. Two bites. Girls are quite elegant, whereas yeah. men just don't. I like to go into the fussy, like, with. I literally looked away and. <laughs> but honestly, I love people watching. It's just mad how people are just like doing their own thing and just like walking past with it, like, no, saying what anyone else is doing. Touch down in Liberty on the Christmas floor. Look at this. Wow. Did anybody ever watch that show years ago about Liberty London? It was amazing. Oh, look at this. 12 Days of Christmas Bobo. <gasps> Gorgeous. Look at how fab all the stuff is. This is all like the sparkly Christmas stuff. And then. wagon with all the stuff on oh my god look at all the blue stuff so so pretty you know i expected nothing less from these to be fair just so so pretty look at the moon <gasps> oh my god now i love this theme <gasps> proper jungle vibes i absolutely love this this is very in this year by the way oh wow how much is he no, I need him, you know. I love all this colour scheme. Like, this is kind of what I want to do. Just maybe not as jungly. Oh my god, look at all these quirky ones. Oh my god, it's a little banjo. No use. Amazing. But similar to the Harrods one. Oh my god. Look at all this traditional crimbo stuff. No, I've had. <laughs> 
queen on a bauble. Stop that. I'm howling. Oh, these are cute, aren't they? These are giving me like major Harrods vibes, to be honest. Wow. There's literally a bauble for everyone, whatever talent they have. Like, literally, a bauble to suit everyone's need. Oh my god, they have them on John Lewis. I'll tag them in the um, description. The gorge. Oh my god, stop it. Calculator for a mathematician. Oh my god, is there anything interior designy? I feel like they're fitting everyone in apart from me. What's that? No. Oh my god, they've got nothing for an interior designer. That's the only thing that's lacking. It really is. Oh my god, I am actually having a ball like Christmas in October. Yes, please. Do you know what I mean? Colourful decorations. Love that. I hope you can get a good impression of it use because it's absolutely gorgeous, you know. These are a bit boring now, you know, like just plain baubles. I just find boring. I know you've got to have them, but boring. Oh, gorge. All the traditional Christmas. Oh, stunning. I love it all. Oh my god, so stressed. Um, our tables in like. 20 minutes and I think you can only be five minutes late and we still haven't left so that's fun um all dressed quick change of outfit and now we're gonna leave but I'll tell you about our whole day when we get back Hey gang, so we are back to the hotel. I look a bit rough in this light actually. I'm um, just gonna get ready for bed. That Harry's bar by the way, unreal. Like literally so, so fab. I can't rate that restaurant enough. We had the most gorgeous meal ever. The service was amazing. Um, got free limoncello. Although we thought we were the favorites and it's clear we weren't because like so many people literally like got Lemoncello. Oh my god, this floor is heated floor. Buzzing. Um, yeah, so after we went there went to the Martini. It's quite quiet in London off like a Monday night. I'm shocked because don't you think like city life should be like 24-7 like buzzing? I don't know. Do you know what I mean? We tried to get into that radio rooftop and it's supposed to be open until midnight because I know like loads of my mates have been to it. So really, they should have let us in, and they were like, "We're not letting anyone in now." I was like, "All right, whatever." So yeah, we couldn't get into there, so we just ended up coming home, which, to be honest, probably a blessing in disguise, because gotta get up early tomorrow and gotta get to Decorex, which is the reason why we've came here. Really, um, just mixing him um, business with pleasure. Do you know what I mean? I'll just be gorgeous, probably loads of interior inspiration. We've, we've booked the Ivy as well for tea, and then we're coming home tomorrow. Short and sweet stay. Okay, anyway, I'm gonna get in the shower. Um, I've brought my little Finland interiors jammies, you know, to match the vibe of the place. Um, and then we're gonna be up early for breakfast. Get up early, Decorex, super excited. So, see you. It's not working. It doesn't look like anybody in this one. Oh, it likes me. No. This way first, so we just dropped our bags and coats off, so we're feeling a bit more like comfortable. And we're just gonna start making our way around the gorgeous stands. Lives in charge of the map. Um, it looks gorgy, and I've just seen the most amazing big place so far. So I want to get my picture on it. Shock.
my god, house and garden mag. Designed this store beautifully. Gorgeous couch as well. We love that. Might get a pick on that to be honest with you, you know me. Love that. Beautiful. 55 South, luxury lifestyle. Love that lamp. Sofa's gorgeous as well. Oh, there's a little book. The accessory catalogue. Love that for the aesthetic. Now, this is called Cucavora Lighting. I think I've said that right. Oh my wow, look at these lights. They are beautiful. So, so gorgeous. Wow, look at that. I even love the wallpaper and they've got a bouquet chair. I know it's not relevant, but wow. look at that light. My God. Even just these pictures, like for aesthetics. Oh, I love a good light, you know. Love a good light. Oh my God, the most unreal couch. That finish is just insane. How gorgeous! Absolutely love it. So this is the bar they've designed as well. I think we're gonna go in there for a drink later. I don't like the way they've done a rug hanging, but yeah, they've designed this for a drink. Curtains. It's very like circus vibes. But yeah, there's a free tote bag going there. Got my free tote. First freebie. <laughs> God, don't these boucle chairs just hit differently? <gasps> oh my God, I'm gonna go and have a look when they get off the couch, to be honest. I really think this is my favorite stand. The pop of color, the Jonathan Adler vibes, and this boucle curved sofa. Wow, I think it's just beautiful. So contemporary, absolutely love it. Doesn't that just put Fenlon Interior Studio to shame? Look how unreal this is. This stool of dreams. Oh my and god. It's with these finishes, wow. Oh my god, I can't even go. Oh wow. Oh wow. No use, look at the finish on that chair. Sorry, are we coping right now? Oh wow. Sorry, I'm multitasking, but like the finish on this chair. Not over it. These little side tables are gorgeous as well. Oh my god. The cabinet of dreams. I'm not going to open it because I'm scared to touch anything because these are like in Harrod, so <laughs> no thanks to getting a damages charge. That chair is, the style of that chair is fab and so is the fabric. I think you can change the finish of the fabric, which is perfect. But oh wow. I love this panelling idea as well. I think it's just for the store, but. Gorgy. Let's see what's through here. Oh wow. Look at that chair. I can't even cope. I love the style of that. An eclectic, modern. Wow, just wow. Everything about the oh my god, them tables. <gasps> Stop. Wow. They are insane. Wow. This girl's been painting for three days. Wow, love that, fair play to her, she smashed it, looks fab, oh my wow, this is giving me major looks vibes, look at this, no stop it, is this a boot play mirror, no, oh my god, game change you guys, I love that lamp as well, how luxurious is this, look at it, love that, love these mirrors, Love a fabric mirror. Wow. The quality of them throws could not be beaten, by the way. Like, honestly. Oh, I love that. Oh my god, like, can I just take this, please? Buy it off the shelf, kind of thing. So many unreal bits. They're like, giving me, like, proper um, Cavalli vibes. Oh, wow. Look at that mirror as well. Love that. That's gorgeous. Look at that one. Feels a bit weird, not gonna lie, but it's gorge. God, can you see them rugs already? They're huge. That pattern is beautiful. It's called Future Hand Knotted in Wool. 400 by 300 centimetres, that is ridiculous. Wow, look at the detail of that. So, so far. My God, you are having the best time. So we've got a little nosy around the stalls. I'm desperate for a drink and maybe something to eat. Um, but there is like queues everywhere. And then there is a talk that we want to see at three called Storytelling and Interior Design. It looks amazing. And 
which is great for note taking, do you know what I mean? Like learning off the best. So I think we're gonna go to this cafe, it's called Liberty Cafe, I'll show you. Liberty Cafe. Just got a hot chocolate or something. I think there's like a vegan cafe, so I might go there. Because they'll probably have like oatmeal for Wednesday. Let's have a look. Somebody wanted to get involved in the interior design action. I absolutely hate pigeons, like flying rats. Fun. No. Here we are. Just stopped off for a little coffee. Well, hot chocolate for me. Um, we've just been sitting next to Laura Hammett. Lives part of there. And she was like, she texted me. <laughs> we were literally sitting over the road for each other. And she was like, is that it? And I was like, who's like now? I wanted to ask her so much for a picture, but I thought that would probably be embarrassing, but I probably would have done it. But then she started eating a lunch and thought, we can't do that, Ellie. You just got not But I really wanted to. But we're going to watch her talk now, aren't we? So it doesn't start till three, but um, we were all queuing before for this other um, talk that was on. And people started queuing at like half past, so like, I want a good spare. So I'll probably, we'll probably go over at like quarter to and queue for 15 minutes. I'm excited to learn. I love listening to people in like the same field. That's why I love doing my podcast. Because like, it's just nice to get to know people. But that's how me and Liv met. Did you know this? The story of me began. So basically in lockdown, we just messaged each other and look at us in our best lives in London. So social media is amazing, you guys. No going back now. Yeah, there's no going back now. She's stuck with me, she's had, she's had a nightmare with me. Have a nightmare. <laughs> Maybe back down the ball. Um, I don't know whether I'll be able to record at all, but if I can record little snippets, I'll pop them in. Um, but if not, I'll tell you all about it, obviously, afterwards. We're just in this Liberty Cafe, yeah. It's very vibey, isn't it? It's very, very nice. And then there's all the stalls and that. I'm actually buzzing that I've been. I've never actually been to this event before. Have you been? First time. First time as a Decorex Club. Um, but no, anyway, we'll go and um, start queuing this tour. Might have to do it a wee beforehand because I think that you get like locked in. Well, I don't mean that, you know, but you know, you know what I mean. Okay. Use, this is the queue. Can you cope right now? <laughs> Background and different religions, different different form of how the space is designed, I think it's an orientated. Um, a lot of that is done with the people in the concept of if, or space planning is even presented. Right, we're back. Um, lives free to kill her. Shock. <laughs> her little legs are all seven foot and compared to, to Liv. Everyone, like, any time, like, if they ever come into, like, work, everyone's like, I didn't think you were that tall in real life. This is just, like, a high different scenario. <laughs> About seven foot, not good. Um, we've just had a ball. That event that we wanted to go to, um, we literally couldn't get in. We were three people from the front. And he would not let us in, so that was funny. Um, so we tried to like gag in at the back, and then this fellow was like a bit of a job's away, and he was like, I'll get told off if you stand in there. Horn we were even in anyone's way. is amazing i will insert a clip but oh wow it's like an outdoor terrace and that's the like, actual outdoor bit i've never been to the chelsea garden one but yeah the menu's looking good i've just asked for the veggie menu because i'm that girl i didn't show our food last night and i'm doing the same again we just got truffle out of chini it was so good there's one left that's the next one oh do you want it inside scoop on that wow very truffly but not too truffly Yum. <laughs> Yous, I don't know what I have and I haven't recorded. I've recorded a lot of my phone to be fair. Um, how gorgeous the eyes, you look at it now, it's gone dark. Oh my god, that was so good, so I think it's... It's so gorgeous. Major vibes. Food was phenomenal. Um, but we are about to head off home. What did we have? We had arachini, sweet potato, jasmine rice, truffle mash, wow, and then a chocolate bomb dessert. I hope I can insert the clip here. I'll be good. I'm gonna go back to the hotel, grab our lounge with the train, and then we've got a two hour train journey home. So, yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this vlog. I hope you've enjoyed Decorex and I hope you've enjoyed our meals and everything else. Any questions, please do let me know. Um, I absolutely love London, I can't wait to come back. Make sure you are subscribed to my channel, there's lots of Christmas and autumn content on the way, so you don't want to miss it. And yeah, I'll see you on my next video. Bye!